Hey guys, how's it going? And today we are checking out the Commonwealth Responders quest mod by Tuesday. This mod offers 28 new quests, 27 new outfits, 30 new buildable items, and 52 buildable signs, as well as expands the area of Jamaica Plain so that you can create a new responder settlement. This gives you the option to recruit new members, give them jobs, and defend your territory. Unfamiliar, the Responders is a faction from Fallout 76 that have now been implemented into Fallout 4 via this mod. So to start it, we simply travel to Sanctuary here and cross over the bridge. And right there, we gain our quest, and we're gonna listen to the <coughs> and we're gonna listen to the emergency broadcast. Excuse me. All right, I uh, have my radio turned off for copyright reasons, but uh, regardless, the broadcast is up, and so now we know where to travel to. Oh, there is a quest marker. I just didn't see it. <laughs> okay but yeah we'll record uh 15 to 20 minute episodes until this thing's done and this will kind of come out alongside of our mod reviews and stuff like that first episode was supposed to be recorded yesterday but uh <laughs> i couldn't figure out how to start the quest <laughs> and so i finally found it today after some uh quick research that i could have easily done yesterday but hey it is what it is all right, we're going to ignore all that and head into the apartments and see if we can assist whoever is in hiding here. But yeah, I'm really excited to see... Hey, whoa, whoa, down, okay. What is going on here? Thank you. I'll take your ammo. Ooh, a responder. Fire breather outfit and helmet. I will gladly take that. All right then. A red army remnant? Hello. Submarine uniform. Yeah, please. That sounds awesome. I don't know if that's part of this mod or a different mod, but hey, still cool. All right. Another responder. He also has the Oh, fireman is different. Fireman helmet and outfit. I'm going to take those two so we can grab all of the new content offered in this mod. Not going to lie, that guy kind of scared me. Uh, another fire. Wait, this one says fireman. Costume. Is it different? Okay, well, we'll see. And then this one says fireman uniform. They're all different, but all have to do with firemen here. Um,. Technical document, okay. Overdue book. Anything else? No. Move the. Oh, oh! Juggling. Joe's note. To whoever finds this, look for Jake Campbell. Just search for the three flamingos guarding the door. That's not enough information, I feel like. Um, we'll go out this way. Find Jake Campbell. So hopefully there's a marker because uh, three flamingos just isn't enough for me. Not if I'm being honest. I, I I don't know where that is. But yeah, guys. Um, if you are interested in this mod at all, I would definitely say check it out. I've seen some people going back and forth on this mod, but it seems really cool. Especially adding in a completely new faction. I was just contemplating. I've been talking with you guys about starting up a new Fallout 4 playthrough. But I did know how to make it unique. And this is a mod that adds a completely new faction. So, you know, maybe a responder playthrough is possible. It seems pretty cool. All right, let's uh, see where our marker is here. Oh, it's at Mystic Pines. That's not far at all. But yeah, uh, a responder playthrough might be something that's possible now. And definitely something that nobody's done before because this mod just came out. <laughs> so it might be cool rebuilding the responders in Fallout 4. All right, I'll grab a Nuka Cola Quantum while I'm here. Ooh, and a bunch of drinks. Sweet. Oh. Okay. Um. Oh, there's a note. I want them alive. Listen carefully. We have been chasing these guys for weeks. We finally have them trapped, and what happens? Half of our guys die. Find him and bring him to Corvega. Okay, so we came all the way over here for that. Alright, but there's a cool little... Oh wait, 
Hollow tape. Log one. Playing it. This is Jay Campbell, responder volunteer. I don't know what happened. They told me to stay here in case Preston comes back. But I'm sure that son of a bitch just left us here. The others, they went into the city to cover Preston's escape. And now I, I keep hearing all this gunfire. And I just don't know. I don't know what to do now. Oh fuck. They're right there. So they actually linked it to Preston Garvey. That's a, a brave choice to tie it into the lore, but I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, that guy just throws grenades, I guess. Tommy. There we go. Interesting, though. So they tied up into Preston, and what I'm assuming is when Preston had to leave uh, with the Minutemen out of Quincy. So that's pretty cool. I, and I'm pretty sure that this mod is intended for a new playthrough of the game. Ooh, stutter, stutter, stutter. So, might be best to start up a new character, but I'm playing on a high-level character and it works just fine, so you do you. But a new character would probably make the most sense. We'll take these guys out. Oh, we can't get up easy that way. We gotta go around. But, yeah, let me know what you guys think about the mod below, and if you want to keep watching the series, because that is something I take into account. I mean, it's a quest line, so it's not something that's easy to show in a single mod review video, and I really wanted to do a super edited, finish the mod, record all the footage, and tie it all together, and just kind of review the mod, which I might do at the end, but uh, I, I work full-time, and having be, being able to do that is, is a lot. I, I want to keep content coming out for you guys on the daily, so I feel like this is the best of both worlds. You'll still get to see everything, but, you know, you just got to stick around and enjoy the, the playthrough. And anytime you want to drop out, feel free to and play it for yourself. But until then, you're watching this, so let's make it as, as good as possible. So we are in Corvega. Oh, okay. More raiders. Hi, how are you? If you're going to come at me with a grenade, maybe you should use it. Shit. This is not my uh, character with the proper leveled lists. So some of these guys have no weapons. Oh, maybe it's just a few of them. Because so, the rest of these guys do. Alright, we need to go up. So, this way... I always get lost in Corvega. Um, we have to go down and then up, right? Something like that. We have to like loop around through the... I think we had it right over there. There's like a little hallway or something we need to go through. Let me find it. I think it's this one where the turret was. Uh-oh. Hi, how are you? Ow! Didn't appreciate that. Alright. Through here. That's what I was missing. And then up these stairs? Hey, hey, hold on. Okay. Not those stairs. These stairs. Nope. Um... Okay, so we're maybe maybe we're a little bit lost. Uh, uh, these these stairs, I found it. You thought I wouldn't find it. I heard you thinking it. Hey, I'm right here. I actually, always really like the design of Corvega. Like it's confusing as it is. If you know what you're doing, it's a really cool place like maybe not the design of how you travel through it but like what it looks like it's a really cool location all right thank you all right all 
right? Excuse my dogs in the back there. This is going to be a little less edited, so you might hear a bark here and there. They can be a little ornery. But it's just kind of what it is right now until I get a, my own recording studio. <laughs> Which hopefully is coming soon. I thought I was out of ammo there. I clicked and nothing happened. Okay, we have to get up on the roof? I don't know how to do that off the top of my head. Oh, wait. Right, now it's right here. Handcuffs, bobby pin, another log. Ugh, okay. This is Jake Campbell, responder volunteer. Or, in this case, responder hostage. I only have a few minutes before the Raiders come back. The Raiders found me back at Mystic Pines. I managed to kill one of them, but there were just too many of them. They knocked me out and brought me to God knows where. The Raiders told me about what happened at the apartment building. And now they want to know where the others are. I told them I didn't know. I told them they all left. But if these Raiders are looking for them, I need to warn them somehow. If I could just pick these fucking handcuffs, I'd be out in no time. Either way, when I escape, I'll head north and follow the power lines until I'm out of Lexington. I'll never find this holotape with all this crap laying around. Hell, they probably don't even know what a holotape is. Ah, shit. The Raiders are coming back. Jake Campbell signing off. Alright. That didn't really tell us where he was, but he is gone. So, gone where? Let's find out. And hopefully we can find him within this episode, because man, if we end this and don't even find the main character of the new quest, that'd be... That'd be something. So I wasn't sure what 28 quests was going to look like, but I, I assumed them to be linear, and it looks like they are. And they're pretty short, but like, not in a bad way. They're, they're, go here, do the thing, okay, next objective. Which is fine, there's 28 of them. And it looks like there's a lot of content outside of that too, like... If you really do get to recruit NPCs to be part of the, uh, to be part of the responders, that's pretty cool. I mean, like you, th that's the whole idea of the Minutemen in the base game. But if, uh, if you could actually send them on jobs, like, man, I wish you could do that. I'm tired of doing all the dirty work for Preston. And if that is the functionality, I I've yet to see it, so I don't know. But if that is the functionality, like, please somebody make a mod to introduce that feature to the Minutemen where you can send your Minutemen on missions to do stuff because god that would be cool all right we found him sweet hey hey there don't worry i'm not gonna shoot you i could see you coming from a mile away i could tell that you weren't a raider i'm jake jake campbell responder volunteer and i swear those raiders they're gonna pay for what they've done but in order for that to happen, I'm going to need some more people. After all, I can't go after them all by myself. I know that there are still responders out there. I just need to reach out to them somehow. You know, maybe if I can get to one of those pre-war relay stations, I could send out a message. All I would need is a manual on how to override a signal. You know, how about we make a deal? If you can get me that manual, I'll pay you, what, 100 caps? What do you say? Yeah, sounds good. I'll help if I can. Great, I'll be heading to that relay station then. When you found a manual, you can meet me there. You can find a manual at the Electrical Hobbyist Club. I'm gonna pack my things and head for that relay station. I'll see you there. Alright, so with that, I think we'll call it there. And I want to hear from you guys. If you've made it to this point in the video, you're obviously at least somewhat interested in this mod. First of all, do you want to see me finish it to the end? And secondly, do you want to see a full playthrough of Fallout 4? I've talked about it on my Discord, and I've seen people talking about it in the comments. Uh, but I want to make sure that that's genuinely something that all of you guys want to see and not just a vocal minority. So let me know in the comments, do you want to see a full Let's Play? And also answer this question for me because I don't know. Would you want face cam or not? I'm happy with either, so you let me know. Alright, I will see you guys in the next one. And really quick, I'm going to show off the armors that we collected this episode. And then that'll be it.
But until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.